Hi everyone, it's meteorologist Justin Stapleton. Let's take a peek outside for your click to Houston.com forecast. Look at this temperatures cooling off quickly. We knew this would be the case. We've got 49 in Cleveland, 50 into Conroe, mid to upper 50s and low 60s, though, still as you get a little further south. But look how much cooler it is than just 24 hours ago. Some 20 degrees cooler in Conroe and Huntsville, Liberty at about 17 degrees cooler. And then close to 15 degrees cooler as you get down towards Pearland and Hobby. Now the winds have been slowly relaxing from north to south. They will continue to do so as we head in towards the overnight hours tonight. And speaking of, as we go overnight towards, well, let's say about two, three, four o'clock, we'll see those temperatures hold in the mid to upper 40s. And likely see a couple of mid 40s, especially as you go north of I-10 for tomorrow morning. Nice little warm up though as we get in towards tomorrow afternoon. We'll get up to around 60 degrees. Are going to keep a lot of cloud cover around from the storm system that's coming in from the west, and that is going to come into play for much of our holiday forecast. Here's what it looks like. See that area of low pressure is kind of spinning off of the Southern California coastline and all this Pacific moisture that's being pulled in from the west. And so as it's bringing scattered showers across El Paso and North Texas now, we'll see that a lot of that cloud cover keep us under, we'll call it fairly overcast conditions for most of our Friday forecast. So starting off Friday morning and into the afternoon, not much left in terms of rainfall. Could maybe get a quick sprinkle, uh, but the majority of the rain will all start to pull on through here as we get in towards Saturday afternoon and evening. So that does include your New Year's Eve plans, which may have to be indoors for many of us, not only through the afternoon, but in through about 10, 11 o'clock. Some of that real heavy rain pushing eastward, which is good, but there is enough that we will likely keep things on the soggy side at times overnight going in towards New Year's Day, still looking at a potential for some scattered shower activity as well. So as we ring in 2017 officially, we'll keep the temperatures on the mild side in the mid to upper 60s, but we'll be dodging some rain showers, overcast conditions, and just an occasional Hey, uh, brief heavy downpour at times. So parties inside, probably the best plan for our Saturday afternoon and evening. Bringing in 2017, not bad. Temperatures around mid to low 70s. We'll keep those 70s around for Tuesday, but then as we transition from Wednesday to Thursday, stronger Arctic cold front moves on through, and that'll get us down into the 50s as we go into the first official weekend of 2017. That's your forecast from right here at clickthehouston.com. Make sure you follow us on Facebook and Twitter. We'll continue to fine tune that holiday weekend forecast as we get new model information in with that uh, new rain chances sliding on through as well. And don't forget, if you're traveling this weekend as well, you can get your weather needs right here anytime you need it at clickthehouston.com.